Turning to the deadly shooting at the Fort Lauderdale Hollywood International Airport. Today, Broward County leaders and the FBI are trying to pinpoint the person they say leaked sensitive surveillance video of the shooting. CBS 4's Kerry Codd is live in Fort Lauderdale where county commissioners met this morning on that video we've all seen. Right, Kerry? That's right, Elliot. The beginning of this morning's county commission meeting here in downtown Fort Lauderdale focused on the events of last Friday, and the county mayor gave a forceful reaction to the leak of that surveillance video of the shooting from last Friday to TMZ. At this time, we would like to exercise a moment of silence. It was a somber start to Tuesday's Broward County Commission meeting. Each commissioner expressed their condolences to the victims of Friday's shooting at the Fort Lauderdale Hollywood International Airport and thanked those who worked to stop the suspect, Esteban Santiago, and those who tried to help those murdered and wounded. Let's not let this act <clears throat> stop us from living fully uh, because we must still live fully. Broward County Mayor Barbara Sharif spoke prior to the meeting about the leak of the airport surveillance video to TMZ. She said it appears that someone recorded the video off a monitor with a cell phone, and in that recording, you can see the reflection of the person who did it. We enhanced the video, and in it, you can see a few body parts, like an arm on the right side of the screen and a hand in the middle area. Sharif said further enhancement shows the law enforcement agency the person works for. That is a huge trust issue for us. We want to make sure that people understand that when they have a security clearance of that level to view sensitive information, that they hold that close to heart and they know what that means for the general public and for us. Sharif said the identity of the person who recorded the video and possibly leaked it isn't known, but the county asked the FBI to investigate. We're told there were multiple law enforcement agencies who had access to that video. Sharif said she's talking about it because she wants the public to know that no one from the county's airport staff leaked the video. That video shows uh, the last seconds of someone's life, and their family member has to continue to look at that every single day on national television. I reached out to the FBI this morning to see if they had any updates into the investigation of this video leak. They told me they do not. Live in Fort Lauderdale, Kerry Codd, CBS 4 News.